Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Conscious Experiences with Natasha here. Noah as well, hanging out over there, watching some Elmo and playing with some blocks. So today we're here to talk about how to quit smoking using an e-vape. Don't worry about it. I know this is scary only because you're afraid that with the nicotine addiction that you have, you're going to have extreme aggression and mood swings. But no, here I've got a solution for you. And that is using an e-vape uh, in alternative with cigarettes at the beginning and then cutting off of the cigarettes completely at the end. So one of the reasons why I'm, I'm using this method to quit smoking is because quitting smoking really made things hard for me. I would have a lot of the mood swings and the irritability that goes along with the addiction, um, I guess the withdrawals of cigarettes. And I've been using an e-vape for quite a while now. I'm down to where I'm only smoking two or three cigarettes a day and you can do the same thing too. And then next week I will be completely off of cigarettes and be sharing that video with you as well to show you that uh, it's it's possible and I'm successful at it. I'm, I've gone this far and I'm not turning around. I'm not backing up. I'm not walking backwards, right? So first thing that you need to know is that there are alternative options. I've tried them, the nicotine patch, the lodgings that you, you suck on, and then the gum. Each one of those things I had a side effect with, the patches I'd try to put on my arm, you can't sleep with them, at least I couldn't because I have nightmares and I guess you're not, it's not recommended to sleep with them anyways, but you know, whatever. And also, um, the, the lodgings, they numbed my throat completely and it felt like the gag reflex constant. In the gum, nasty, same thing as the, the lodgings. So I would get an irritated skin patch wherever those patches were, it would be all rashy around it and that really didn't help me. but. Here's a new option we're going to talk about right now, using the e-vape. So one of the great things about this is that you're still creating the action. I'm not going to smoke it in here, but you're putting it up to your mouth. And that's what I've found that I'm most addicting, and addicted to, is the uh, action of smoking. And how cold turkey wasn't an option for me in the first place. I think that a lot of it is the act of it you're not continuing when you're using one of those other products to help you. And so far, um, research has shown that e-vapes uh, has nowhere near the health uh, problems. It is not as harmful for your body as smoking cigarettes by any means. Uh, obviously, there's still some research going on on all of these products, but so far at this point, research has discovered that it is not as harmful for your body and it also it delivers that nicotine or and the action all together all in one so that's what's really helped me along the way and I want to share with you my experience in buying my e-vape and where I went um, if you're over here from the St. Louis area hello what's up in the house over here in my house <laughs> anyways um, I'm south of St. Louis, so Southern Missouri, hey, what's up? We went to uh, Stella's Blues, which is, oh my gosh, the best experience I've ever had with going to an e-vape store. Usually you walk in and there's this giant wall of just a thousand different flavors and you're like, oh my gosh, is there really this, is it this hard? Some places, but not at Stella Blues. And here's their logo. So Stella Blues, when you walk in and it's like yeah. you're visiting a friend. That's the atmosphere and the home, the homey, welcoming yeah. feeling you get when you walk in there. They do have a countertop full, but it reminds me of a hookah bar. I mean, if you've ever seen one of those, it's similar. Not exactly, yeah. but so they have vapes already ready to go with uh, your own brand new in the package top that your mouth touches. So you get to try every flavor they have if you wanted sit there and have some conversations and just talk and at the end of it I bought this vape, which is here it comes with a new tank new cartridge new everything um 
despite this piece, this is the only one you get in the box. And the charger is a standard charger. You can use your cell phone charger if you wanted to save the one you have here. This vape here was literally only $60. And my juice was $30. So yes, you have to invest a little bit. I mean, you're quitting smoking. You would have to invest anyways, right? But you will, and I do, save a lot of money. I was spending hundreds of dollars on cigarettes now. One month, one bottle. $30. One month, one bottle. That's all. Can you imagine? Do you remember? Or if you've already quit smoking, yeah. Do you remember how much a carton of cigarettes is? Well, in Missouri here, it's a lot cheaper than somewhere else. Like I used to live in Iowa. Well, you'd be spending $80 on just a carton of cigarettes. And some people, that only lasts them two weeks. So there's a huge benefit of quitting is saving that money and alternatively smoking the e-juice and it does have nicotine this one specifically has eight milligrams and then what i recommend is starting at the higher level and then working your way down then i'm going to go to six after this and then three after this and then from there just the juice whoa look at that baby what are you doing no okay. no don't climb the window okay. no no you hear me no Raising toddlers. That should be another video. No, don't. Okay, back to the topic at hand. Ah, I love being a mom. So, when I went in there, it was like we were just sitting down having a great conversation and they mixed the liquids right in front of you so you can see that you're getting the freshest service possible. And not only the service, but the freshest e-juice possible. Right there in front of your face, they show you what they're doing, they take apart your brand new purchased e-vape cigarette thing. <laughs> and they show you exactly how to put it together. It, it was extremely simple. Yeah. Now I'm going to take you outside and show you how much if you were to invest in the $60 that this one costs, how many, or how much you, you can uh, get in the smoke return. So mine will keep track of how many puffs you've taken, the quality, and when you need to change your coil. And you can change your settings to more or less. A lot of people, uh, they said in the store at Stella's, is, uh, they keep it around 50 and 60. So in between there somewhere. Uh, it can go down. And uh, another thing I recommend is lowering this as you go along with the quitting. So let's go outside really fast and I'll take a puff and show you the amount of smoke, I guess, release. It's not smoke, silly girl. It's not smoke. It's vape. Vape juice. So, here we go. Now that is only at 57. That is where I'm doing it. I don't usually take such a big puff, but I wanted you to see that you get the same feeling smoky as you do with when you're smoking, which is kind of the addiction a lot of us have is the act of it and the feeling rather than the actual nicotine. So going back in, what is he doing? <gasps> Crazy baby. Welcome back to my kitchen table everybody i want to thank you for watching uh my advice and how i'm quitting smoking and joining me on this journey thank you for watching conscious experiences with natasha have a great day